Glad you're back, marine science fans. This is Kevin from the Seymour Marine Discovery Center on the beautiful UC Santa Cruz Coastal Science Campus. Join me for this sea star investigation that'll really make you flip. If you've been lucky enough to go tide pooling along the California coast, you may have spotted some sea stars, like these bat stars. Most types of sea stars move pretty slowly. That's why some people don't realize they're alive and need to stay underwater. But if we change our perspective to sea star time, you'll see for yourself how active they truly are. Now check out this time-lapse video and you'll see what I mean. As you watch these sea stars in action, see if you can spot any special body structures they're using to help them sense their surroundings. Are you noticing all those tiny tentacles waving around? Those are special structures called tube feet. Those thousands of tiny tube feet have more than one function. They both sense and then respond to what they detect in the environment. The tube feet help the sea star respond by moving toward or away from whatever they sensed. Now that we have a good sense of how sea stars use their tube feet to sense and respond to their environment, it's time to investigate further. The ocean's a constantly changing environment and a hard place to survive. If you're a sea star living in an area like this, where the energy from powerful waves can easily knock you off and flip you over, how do you recover? To answer that question, let's run a simple observational experiment back at the marine lab. If we flip this bat star, will it be able to sense that it's upside down then find a way to flip back over. Think about how it might be able to use its tube feet to detect that it's upside down. And predict the approach the bat star might take as it tries to flip itself back over. Watch the time-lapse video to observe what the bat star does first, next, and last to right itself. That was an incredible feat. Now take a couple minutes to draw and write your observations and share them with a partner. How do you suppose a bat star coordinates those thousands of tube feet to sense that it's upside down and then move its body back into a safe position? Discover what's going on inside a sea star to coordinate this amazing feat. Watch a sea star's body systems revealed in an amazing animation at the Shape of Life website. This video featured portions of a five-part lesson sequence supporting the next generation science standards. For the complete lessons, including student science journal pages, visit the Seymour Center Distance Learning website. Go to seymourcenter.ucse.edu and please make a donation while you're there so we can continue to provide you with great resources. Thanks.